hello guys welcome to my channel Nate Kash on webtech zone in this video today we are going to learn how to create rules uh, to forwarding your emails uh, from specific sender or person okay so you can create the rules to forward your emails from specific email address or person in outlook so i'm just going to show you in this video tutorial so guys let's start with the video before you starting i request you to like this video hit the like button subscribe my channel and don't forget comments below so guys let's start with the video here in my uh, mailbox okay so first you have to uh, create rules go to the home and here you have to find the rules so under the uh, move option you can find the rules okay if you don't find this option here in home tab you can customize your ribbons just right click on here go to the customize in ribbons ribbons and here you have to add you have to find out this move option or this move option you have to find and just add add from here to here just click and add it will be add here and now just click on ok so I don't find here because I already add it add to my home you can see in home tab I have move uh, option you can see ok so uh, after add go to the um, rules and go to the manage rules and here you can see if you are using the more than one email id or e mailbox you can switch mailbox in which mailbox you have to apply the you need to uh, you want to apply the rules so just switch the mailbox if you are using more than one e mailbox so i just switch with the gmail account and i, I have already created the rules here so this is my rules for the forwarding mail okay i just delete i don't want it I just delete you can delete those from here okay so for forwarding emails from specific person or sender we need to create rules go to the new rules here and here you can see some condition you can create the rules but there is a no any condition by default here to create the forwarding rules for that you need to come down here and start from blank rules and just click on applying rules for message receiving message okay and just click on next after next here okay from you have to select first email id so you can also forward emails with the specific word in subject or specific word in account you know body email body okay so i just find out uh, if you want to add email id or someone email id just add click on from people or public groups then click next okay so here you have to add value just click on add public and here you can add the contact number from your contact list just you can switch your contact list from here and just add the contact here it will be add here you can also add manually if you want you can see your contact double click on it it will be see the contacts you can also add manually like this or you can add multiple emails by entering semicolon here and type the another email id next email id and you can add multiple email id here i just add one email id okay just add one email id if you want to select all just select all okay okay you can select all like this just select and just drag like this and just click the okay just select and just click on from the all email id will be added here okay so now i add one email id only so it is add now just click on next now there is another condition you have to select so we are looking for forwarding message okay so forward it to people or group or forward it to people or group as attachment so you can also forward as an attachment your email id emails uh, if someone send if this person send you the email it will be forward as an attachment and if you want to forward as an email you can click on it now you have to enter the email id to where you want to forward just click here and add the email id from here or you can also add manually i just want to forward all emails from here from this person 
so two condition has been fill up now just click on next here is the exception you can use there is a lots of exception as per requirement you can use click on exception and you can uh, uh, yeah, you know uh, fill the value here so I don't want to use exception now to finish it so it is finished now and now if I click on apply and ok so it will be applied to the ok let me show you next ok just click next next don't I want to don't exception just click on next and you if you want to run these rules to your existing message or inbox you have to click on it ok and just now you can finish it after finish it will be apply your existing ok I just cancel you can apply with the existing inbox and upcoming or futures emails it will be forward to the selected email id so i just delete for now i don't want it click on ok so it is deleted so guys i hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching